presenting my greatest invention, the Flintlock. <laughs> Bon Louis, Sammy Sam Sam. That sheep costume is beautiful. Ew! And no, I'm clearly a cloud. <laughs> Check it out, Bro Scott's flavorless cotton candy. Oh, uh, no. Quilarious. Hello, Good one, cloud. Baby Ooh, sweet Nimbus costume. I'm a cloud. Oh, sorry. That's what you said. Thanks. Where's your costume? You're looking at it. I'm famed inventor Nikola Tesla. It was either that or Madame Curie. Ooh, good choice. So, did you bring it? Yep. I never knew you were so serious about your Halloween treats. What does it do? Reinforced treat bag featuring hideaway pockets for premium candy bars, a vacuum attachment, and sophisticated fruit rejection system. Trick or treat! Treats! No treats this year! What? Only treats! Well, it was one of the options. <laughs> so you just flew in from Cincinnati, huh? Boy, am I past tired. Oh, this is terrible. I know! I could see old Rick's lips moving. It was pretty obvious. Oh, you mean the no treats thing? Don't worry, there are plenty of other houses in Swallow Falls. Trick or treat! You scallywags want a trick? Treat, actually. Treat? What treat? All the treats have mysteriously vanished from all the Swallow Falls. So y'all gonna have to settle for a trick. <laughs> Look at that. Now that is a trick. <laughs> That's a pretty good trick. Where are the treats? Trick or treat! I got treats. Yes! Woo! Yes! All right! All right! Let's see. A worm for you, and a nice juicy slug for you. I've got a wiggler for you, and this is a nice shiner. You're gonna but watch your fingers. There's, there's hooks in these, so try and don't just pop them in your mouth. Chew around. Doesn't anyone in this town know how trick or treating works? Where are all the treats? The nerd's right. Where are all the treats? Happy Halloween! children of Swallow Falls? As you know, each year the Swallow Falls Halloween Committee spares no expense in buying a lot of candy for little tykes like you. Yeah! yeah! You're awesome, Mayor Shelburne! What a great idea! This year, at my special request, the committee has purchased all the candy at Swallow Falls. Sammy won candy! Trust me, nothing would make me happier than to give it all away. Yeah! But I'm not. No, no, no. I'm hoarding all the candy inside my super creepy haunted house. I'll only give it to you if you can make it through my haunted house of terror. Mayor Shelbourne is kookily wookily if he thinks he can keep me away from that candy. Good ah! luck. Mayor Dad designed that house to be completely ungo-throughable. Just so he wouldn't have to give away any of his Halloween candy? Dad's not big on sharing. I'm going in, dude. Let me at that candy, bro. Come on, just do it. There's nothing to be scared of. It's not even that scary. Ah! Mayor Shelburne keep all that candy for himself? Absolutely, 100% definitely, yes. Oh, yes. Good idea if he does. Eh, I'm kind of on the fence. No! The answer is no! What is wrong with you people? This is Halloween. Those sour balls, those barely chewable toffees, those melted chocolate coins should be ours. Kids dress up, adults give out candy. That's the social contract! Yeah! Listen to that roll of toilet paper. She knows what she's saying. I'm a cloud! And Mayor Shelbourne, 
cannot scare us away. <laughs> okay, people, do whatever it takes to scare them away. Boo, 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 boo. You hire professionals to terrify little children, and this is what you get? I want creepy. I want crawly. Remember, they can take away your lives, but they won't take away my candy. Just get out there and scare those kids. Get your treat bags ready. Oh, that's terrifying. Remember, there's no scientific reason to be scared. You say that, but my dad is an expert in psychological terror. He knows how to use your deepest, darkest fears against you. Really? Look, a puppy. You're scared of a puppy? They soak up all daddy's love. This is not good. Oh, boy, oh, boy, oh, boy. And then there were four. <laughs> you do not scare me, Mr. Mayor, sir. For there is no way you know my deepest, darkest and fear. And then there were four. <laughs> and then there were four. And not the Star Wife! Four. The laziest of all transitions! <laughs> there were three. <laughs> Let's go, gang! <laughs> Hey, don't worry, scaredy nerds. Baby B will keep you safe. No! What is that? What? It's not blood, it's just cherry soda. Diet cherry soda? <gasps> no! Oh. Let's go. Diet soda. Just walk away. Just leave me here to wither and rot. So dry. Remember, Mayor Shelbourne's just trying to scare us. There's an explanation for everything. Ah! Uh, just a trick of the light. <laughs> totally logical. I smell candy. This way. Scared? No way. I'm a scientist. <laughs> Ghosts aren't, aren't real. real. And my treat bag needs filling. They're getting too close to my precious candy. <laughs> if they knew my personal horror, they wouldn't be harassing me. All my life, I've always had a lot of Halloween candy, but never all the Halloween candy. That's all I've ever wanted. Is that so awful? Let me put this nicely. You have no talent. There is nothing in your bag of tricks. What are these, your Aunt Ethel's guest sheets? Hold that trick. Hello, Mayor Shelburne here. How about those actors you sent me? Uh-huh. Uh-huh. They're actual ghosts. Oh, I see. Oh, that's interesting. And tell me, why would real ghosts even want this job? Candy! They're after my candy! Candy! Ah, these ghosts look so fake. Candy! Uh, Flint? Candy. You got an explanation for this? <laughs> Not yet. I'm still analyzing the data. This makes no sense. Ghosts aren't real. Oh, no, they're real. Real, I tell you. Nice try, Mr. Mayor, but we're not going anywhere. No, it's true. They're after my candy. <gasps> they're heading for the candy. After them. Must save candy. Don't open that door. It's full of the... Uh, ooh, give me a sec. Ooh, I'll come up with something scary. Ooh, orange toothpaste? Huh? A bug? A big bug? Okay, a small bug with a big face. Nice try, Mr. Mayor, but the only thing that scares me is not getting that candy. I got a date with a tummy ache. Ooh. Ooh. My candy! Precious candy! <laughs> Mayor looks really upset. What? No! Not again! It begins! <laughs> Expect that. Nobody takes my candy. I've had enough. I want candy. Let us out. Let us out. Let us out. 
I'll let you out, but only if you promise to share the candy. We promise! We promise! There's no more candies? I'm sorry. Candy! Oh, oh, it's raining candy! Yes! Candy! If you refer to figure A in my chart, you can see scientific proof beyond any doubt that ghosts are not really real. Oh, that's a bummer. Yeah. Mm -hmm. children. Who's my little princess? You're a cute little thing. You're... I almost love you. Ah. All this hullabaloo must come to a halt baloo There will be no more chitter and certainly no more chatter while we partake in today's educational science field. Yes! Science movie! How come we never watch movies about the weather? There are so many! Snow girls, fried green tornado, cloudy with a chance of... Push it and shush it! Prepare your hungry brains for this film of utmost scientific seriosity. <laughs> Wait a sec. This isn't about real science? Oh, Knock it off, nerd! I will now alter the course of history by haphazardly assembling body parts and electrifying them in a dramatic yet highly unbelievable fashion to create life! Okay, I'm sorry, but that's not how inventors act. Where's the monkey lab assistant? I don't work like that at all. Because you do boring science. Why don't you do cool science like black and white crazy doctor guy? People love that. I do do cool science, except it's a lot harder than this fakey Hollywood science. Nerd, 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 nerd alarm. <sighs> Stupid Hollywood. More like Hollywood, no signs of it punched him in the tooth. Ugh, it's so full of baloney. That's right, Steve. Oh, come on, Flint. It's just a movie. Yeah, a movie about an inventor. It makes us all look bad. <laughs> you saw him. Look at me. I'm a movie scientist. I'm creating a monster by haphazardly assembling things like this and this and some of this. Ooh. All I need now is a brain. You have your own brain covered? Of course. I'm a member of the Brain of the Month Club. Now, according to the movies, my big dumb monster will come to life just because of some conveniently timed lightning storm that happens to be coming by. Hello, Daddy. Daddy, can we go outside and play? Uh, I'm not your daddy. And you're just a bunch of randomly put together junk. So... Flint, you're gonna hurt its feelings. It has no feelings. See? Oh. See? Stop oh. it! Sam, Stop. Oh. are you watching? Daddy, no poke. It sure sounds like it has feelings. Let's run some tests then. Okay, whatever I say, I want you to show me the appropriate expression. Got it? Okay, Daddy. All right. Love. Ooh. Hate. Ooh. Surprise. Ooh. Envy. Oh. Confusion. Ooh. Boredom. Yeah. Remorse. Oh. Subtle fear of failure. Yeah. Hmm. I guess it really does have feelings. I do. Still, not my son. And I'll prove it. <gasps> hey, Dad. Ooh. Let me ask you something. You're a dad, right? Uh, cool. So, what would you say a dad is? It's like, uh, um, the remora fish and the shark. Yes, the shark offers the remora food and protection while it 
clings to the shark's belly, and in return, the remora eats the shark's parasites. So you, 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 and you are like, um, I, you're a parasite. Dad, you know I can't follow your fishing metaphors. I think what your father is saying is that it's a give and take relationship, but ultimately a dad is like the shark who's responsible for the little fishy. Right, Mr. Lockwood? Something like that, Samantha. Flint, you made him. You have to take care of him. Can we have fun now? Sure. Fun. Hooray! <sighs> Still not my son. Uh, I'll have one of those. And one for my friend. <sighs> And uh, one for my undead creature, too. Oh? Oh. 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 More dead. No, creature, we do not eat all the candy in the display case. Creature, cre again. Not my son. <laughs> so true, bro. LOL. Hey, I just that sound, me in it frightens me, it. Daddy. It it's just it people yet? texting, I'll text creature. You. They do it all the time at the movies. Why would people pay to see a movie and then text the whole time? It's what the living do. Just ask them politely to stop. GTG, okay. This movie is awful. <laughs> oh, yeah. Wow, the 3D is so realistic. That thing just jumped right at me. Wow, I've never enjoyed a movie so much. I could hear everything. Nice work, creature. Thank you, Daddy. <laughs> oh, you know, maybe being responsible for this little guy won't be so bad after all. Oh? <gasps> As the head of this angry mob, I am happy to say we are here to destroy your creature. What? No, you can't do that. That creature is... my son. Oh, if he means so much to you, why do you call him a creature? Well, uh, I just never got around to naming him, so let's just call him Dave. I'm Dave. Oh, hello, Dave. Destroy Dave! Yeah! Why do they hate me, Daddy? Because they don't understand you the way I do. And we must teach them. Listen to me, Mob. Sure. Flint made an inhuman monster cobbled together with pieces of random garbage and human parts, or maybe not human parts. The point is, Dave's worth knowing. I've learned that for myself today. Dave, go on and tell the angry mob a little more about yourself. Oh, okay, Daddy. Well, um, when I say hello, I go... <laughs> I'm Dave. <gasps> Um, possible mommy figure? What? Oh, me? Oh! Why are they so angry at me? I think I can answer that. The mob is angry because they think you are different. But I, who cannot see, know we are the same. Wise words, friend. I have a brain just like them. Just like you. Here, feel it. Ah, so warm, and feels like a real brain. It is a real brain. Ah! Destroy the scary monster! Destroy that scary monster, come on! We won't look for us here. This movie's not very good. How are we going to get away, Daddy? With these random objects jumbled together, I have scientifically oh. invented a teleportation device that defies all dimensional rules. 
cool. Daddy, why don't you do cool science and build a machine like that? Because, Dave, that's not real science. That's movie science. I can't just build an interdimensional teleporter by taking a bit of this projector and a piece of this floor buffer and some stale licorice. Wow, it's so real. And some gum from underneath the seat and a couple of these fluorescent bulbs and the covering off of these cushions and... Wait, you did it! What do you know? Hollywood doesn't lie after all. Son, it's time to go. You'll be safer in another dimension. I don't want to go. I am going to miss you. Oh, that's too much. I I'll miss you too, but you have to go. Not going. There's Dave. Get him! Get him! Get him! Get him! Look, Dave. Candy. Ooh, candy. Nom 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 nom. Bye, Dave. Bye, son. Oh! oh how Parenting is hard. How do I know I did the right thing? We just wanted to rip him apart is all. I mean, come on. You did the right thing. Yeah. You're cute. I'm Laura. Ooh. Where are you from? I do not remember. Want to see my brain?